Are you serious? Are you serious? I'm on the banks of the Ohio River, uh, standing on actually in Louisville, Kentucky, and across the river is southern Indiana. Now, a couple things to know about this area. First of all, Abraham Lincoln, once he became a lawyer, actually would come to Louisville, Kentucky, and would actually be involved in some of the court cases and different things that were going on. He also was born in Kentucky before eventually moving across the river just not far from here in Cordon, Indiana, where he grew up as a teenager before he ever got to Illinois in what's known as the land of Lincoln. Now, something else you should know is when you look at a river, and, the, and of course the Ohio River is a mighty, mighty river, and a fish just jumped a second ago, I just heard it. Uh, it's a mighty river and flows powerfully. Now, in Ezekiel 47, the Bible talks about Ezekiel saying, why don't you come out and wade a little deeper into the river? Some people do it and get up to their ankles. And the, Ezekiel said, well, wade out a little deeper to your knees uh, or even up to your waist. I can tell you here at the mighty Ohio River, right there, if, you, if I just fell off the edge, it's way over my head. It's probably 20 feet deep there, and out in there, it's much deeper. There are catfish in this river bigger than I am, and, they have, and they've caught them in this river. But when the Lord told them to go out a little further, go out a little further, and they got up to their waist, it still wasn't enough. A lot of folks are willing to get a little bit into this, uh, their Christian experience, ankle deep. But as long as you're ankle deep, your whole body's still basically in control. When you get up to your knees, you're a little bit less of you and more of the river. When you, By the time you get to your waist, the river is almost fully controlling your body. And then, he said, swim out over your head. It's at that point the river's in control and you're completely under the, uh, if you will, the anointing of the power of the river. God wants you to swim out over your head. He wants you to get all into God. He wants you to come a little deeper. And so some of you, I know you're saved, but come on, let's go deeper because God has got a destiny and a plan for you. Are you serious? Come on, let's get a little deeper.